Hey y'all, it's Billy and Rhonda from Strong's Adventures and what we're doing today is a little collaboration with Helga from Helga's Pennsylvania Cooking. Now since my mom is from Pennsylvania, we decided we'd get together and do a little collaboration here and we're going to be making, we're going to be making some Bavarian cabbage chowder. Helga's going to be making some cabbage chowder or soup or something. It's going to be, you know. It is soup weather. It is very much soup weather. It may not look like it. We're wearing short sleeves, but you know, it's November. It, it has been a little chilly, so we thought, you know, good thing to do. Yeah. So, Rhonda, what is in this recipe. All right, let's see. I've got your mom's recipe pulled up here. Bavarian cabbage chowder. We need one pound of Polish sausage cut into bite-sized pieces. We need two cups of thinly sliced carrots. Uh, we need three tablespoons of, it says imperial oleo. We're gonna use real butter. Butter's better. Yeah. Two cans of cream of celery soup. And then she has on here to use that can to measure one can of milk and one can of water. And then we need three cups of the cabbage cut in long thin shreds. So all we're going to do is brown these just a little bit. I'm going to throw our butter in there. Don't have to brown them a lot because we're going to saute the carrots in there also. So now we're going to throw our butter in. And our carrots. All right, so we're gonna stir this in. And put our milk in. And grab a glove, cause this is really hot. All right, now that we got everything mixed in there good, We're gonna throw our cabbage in. All right, we're gonna bring that up to a boil. Then we'll put our top on, move it over so that we can just simmer it. And it only simmers for about 10 or 15 minutes. All right, we've got it up to a boil. Or at least it was a boil here a minute ago. Let me get it stirred one more time. I'm gonna get the lid on there. Then we'll move it over to a hook and we'll throw a little bit of coals on the top.
Oh yeah. I'm going to call that done. Oh yeah. Let's get a nice little bowl of this plated up and I'll give you all a taste test. So, we got done with our little collab here with Helga, making our Bavarian cabbage chowder. Let's give it a try. See how we like it. I know how we like it. It's awesome. Mm. Just a little bit of that sausage, a little bit of the carrot, and a lot of that cabbage. Mm. We don't even have salt and pepper in this. That's how awesome this is. Now you need the salt and pepper to taste. Might want to throw a squirrel in there too. If the dogs, you know, get it. But this is awesome. Um, Papa, here's the recipe you were asking. Thanks, Helga, for including us in the uh, collab. And don't forget, there ain't no loving like Dutch oven loving. Go eat you some cabbage, because this stuff is good. Mm. So what do you want to do right now? Yeah, I'm going to read it off again. She gonna read it off one more time. Cause I don't know. I, don't know. I can't splice all this stuff together.